return. All right, guys, so I'm going to teach you guys how to play Gangplank top lane in Season 12 after the buff. So what we have is Grasp, Demolish, Bone Plate, Overgrowth, a Magical, and Biscuits. What we also have is a D-Shield with TP into the Shen matchup. All right, so first of all, I just want to get this out of the way. Gangplank has already been a really good champion for a long time, especially Season 12. And for some kind of reason, Ryo thinks it's not enough, so they decided to buff the passive, but basically give it more damage to the late game. And then they also buffed the W, so you can use it more effectively in lane. And, well, basically use it more often, which is crazy. I don't know why Riot is going this far as to, like, <laughs> changing Gangplank like that. Like, giving him so many numbers, but, uh, sure. <laughs> like, it's honestly not that bad, you know. But anyway, we're playing against some Shen. For this matchup, I purposely took Grasp so we can have a really strong lane. At the same time... I don't want to hit my passive on him. I should proc it before he got the shield off. But yeah, like, the, the plan here is quite simple. We're going to be playing it slowly against Shen. Each time he's going to try moving up to the CS, we're going to try dropping Q's barrels down. We're going to play that poking lane um, as much as possible. I'm going to fit in like another point to my Q here just so I can have that extra damage. So yeah, anyway. The one problem about Gangplank early is that you always have, like, you gotta manage your mana in some way or another. You can go for, of course, you have the, um, you have the regular setup, you can go tier, you can do whatever to get that mana, but for me personally, i much rather go for D-Shield, have that, like, strong early game, like, lots of survivability and just wait it out until you have your first back and then mana becomes no problem anymore. Seems like Lilius up here. So yeah, we're just playing it kind of safe. This is a really good matchup because we can basically W out of Shen Dash and we can always poke him, do whatever we want to do. And we can like basically scale for free. He doesn't really ever get to like hit that barrel. Nice. Take the passive. And now we just chill around here. Like, this is the, the point where you can manage your mana pretty well. Because you're in a spot right now where you can basically hit barrels, like, pretty easily. Hmm. Let's if that doesn't hit. I'm fine with it. We've got the biscuits now, so ma mana becomes less of an issue. I'm gonna try to go for that CS. Hmm, we could probably get like an early kill on him. And he's done. See you later. Like what? It, it kind of comes like a surprise, but so many people don't know about the strength of Gangplank top lane. Most people see Gangplank as like an like a late game champion that all it can do is beat late game but what most people don't understand is that gangplank is actually an early game champion as crazy as it sounds gangplank has some of the best laning phases um just because you can basically spam q all day you got your barrels you got your w you have your ult which basically allows you to get kills across the map so i'm honestly quite impressed with like what people are saying about gangplank I don't really understand where that's coming from. Yes, Gangplank is a really strong late game champion, but I don't know, dude. He is such a great late, like early game champ in so many different ways. I'm not really going to use my TP since Shen is like kind of slow pushing the wave, though we are chilling. Um, also, he's got no flash. That's nice. 
start off with some Qs. Now it's going to be a really bad time for Shen, because we are going to pressure him so much. Huh. Okay. Actually, I thought he was going to keep on going, so that's why I pressed R for him. My bad. I was really expecting to get more, actually. So we're chilling. I don't want to use too many Qs on the CS. Not too many. It does take away the scaling a little bit. It takes a bit longer, but I want to manage my mana in a way that I can keep on queuing him over and over. Oh. <laughs> I'm getting creep blocked so hard. <laughs> That's so, so stupid. Sometimes you have days where you're playing Gangplank and you're like, you have to pass through a wave, but like everything else is like blocking you from getting it. Like that, for example. It's on a hard push. Uh, Shen is trying to roam right now, so... I'm gonna have to force this in. There you go. Brock Demolish. Nice. He's gonna walk himself back. Hmm. I kind of want to stay at the same time. It's not really a good idea, but... I'm gonna force this in. Usually I'm not much of a fan of like overextending this much because we can just go back right now and simply secure the the item. But I'm also thinking about staying for just like two ways more because then I can basically buy the Ascent Reaver. Come back with a huge advantage. I don't think it's gonna try. Bro, I used <laughs> I used the barrel. I didn't want to, man. Alright. No that stupid barrel always in the way. Yeah, right. He tried like stopping me from getting the cannon and extract it actually succeed. <laughs> Unfortunately. Anyway, we can now reset and we can buy my Essence Reaver. So this is where the real fun begins. Got it. I think I'm going to TP and basically force the Shen to stay in the lane. I want him not to go away. Um, he does have TP, I believe. Are you kidding me, bro? <laughs> Worst feeling in the world. Okay. Got the bear ready and set. If he tries to go farm right now, then he's gonna <laughs> he's gonna face a lot of damage. He's not gonna like this. So now we're just playing dead bully. <laughs> he's gonna go through a bad time. I'm going to ping top lane because I think we're about to get free kills. We can dive this guy mega easily. Man, like he totally did not expect it. <laughs> Alright, my man. Appreciate it. Like, Gangplank is such a strong champ, man. So many people don't know. I like how W is like buffed in a way that you can basically use it over and over. Uh, Lilia seems to be top lane. Like we're getting ganked. Yeah. Hello, Lilia. I've got my W, so... Good luck doing whatever you're doing, man. Like, that's not going to work against me. Death 
Let's go for Lucidity. Um, I'm probably going to go for Perales Claw next. Got my ultimate ready and set. So I've got like a two level um two level lead, two kills lead, got like 30 CS lead, several plates, like actually <laughs> pretty much all plates. Except from one. There's one that I didn't get. Um but yeah, that's that's fine. Gotta be a bit careful about Bale because there is going to be a massive fight sooner or later. Got my ultimate ready, wait. Mm, yeah. Hmm. Ah, he survived it. Right. Okay. It is what it is. He flashed away, but yeah, whatever. We are going to get the tower right now, so that's fine. Man, W, like, it literally costs no mana at all right now. <laughs> w is just... It's so much more useful. Wait a second. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's go back to base. So, let's go for Warhammer, and then we also go for the uh, Serrated Dirk. And now we're going mid lane. Uh, quick question, does anyone know what the 200 sex is about? Well, uh, you're, talking, you're probably talking about this, right? Um, well, this basically just makes you upgrade your ultimate. You can upgrade your ultimate three times GP. You just have to keep farming 500 gold or coins, basically. And uh, you can then upgrade your ultimate and it will be better. It will be stronger. So that's basically the idea behind it. And the, the way to get coins is simple. You queue, to a, you queue on the CS or you queue the barrel. You last hit the CS, you gain the coins, basically. That's uh, how it works. Hello, hello. Seems like we're having some fun. Oh, whoops. My bad. <laughs> he dies. <laughs> this is looking awful. Wow. That was just incredibly unfortunate. I'm going to take the, the camp here. There you go. Yeah, that Drake is probably gone. Okay. Shen is chilling top lane. I certainly don't mind. Good luck and have fun there. We are chilling here. Securing everything. Got the red buff. Nice. Okay. We just keep rotating jungle camps. We're like power farming like crazy right now. We're gonna become like a little raid boss soon. Got that one. I don't think he's going to fall for it. Nah. I can upgrade my ultimate right now. <laughs> wow. He actually went for it. Unbelievable. Ooh, we are so unbelievably farmed up already. I actually want to take a look if there's a blue. No. 
He will go back after this camp. Or I suppose what he could try and do. I don't think there's vision. Ooh, I missed that barrel. What? That was like right on the edge. Hmm. That's like right on the edge. That's so unfortunate. Nice. Not bad. Not bad. They're actually going for me there. What? <laughs> Okay. Holy, not work for these guys. Hmm. I actually missed it. Whoops. Hmm. I don't have enough damage to burst her yet. Get back. Yeah, I don't have the barrels anymore. No, I have to go back. I have like 3k gold in the pocket, man. <laughs> but they are pushing the wave, so I might actually stay. Let's secure that wave. Nice. Okay, let's get Prowler's Claw. And then we will also get Collector next. Now we can finally upgrade my ultimate. <laughs> it's been a while, man. <laughs> We have, we farmed up like 800 coins, man. <laughs> I could have upgraded like a long time ago already. <laughs> oh. Actually, I expected better. Wait, what? Last try. Wait a second. There we go. I actually want to uh, take the blue as well, but I don't necessarily need it. Because we, we aren't running out of mana anymore. Hello? Bro, are you kidding me? <laughs> Meanwhile, top lane, like, Shen chill, uh, chilling up. Thank you. Got a good tower. Man, our damage is absolutely... It's starting to become insane. Got it. that be enough? Oh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> that was so close, man. He was getting two shields at once. Shen, uh, Shen shield and then also Lulu shield. Unfortunately. Let's go for this one. We like, we, we literally need 17 coins. To get to upgrade my next ultimate. Literally. So we only needed like one more wave. And now we have to like go all the way to the wave. Then reset by the next uh, ultimate. Feels bad man. Do I look like 
like a patient man. I could TP right behind it. I don't think they realize. Eh? So they have vision. Okay. So they have vision on me. That's interesting. Missed it. Also missed it. Oh, that's like one barrel. Insane. You know, people telling me that Ganklink uh, is in a bat, like a bad champion in some way or another, like you're crazy, man. Like, barrels are legitimately doing like more than like 1,000, maybe even 1,500 damage each, and we're only like three items in the game. We're, we don't even have the um, we don't even have the Infinity Edge yet. We're still gonna buy it. Oh man, the damage. <laughs> this is an absolute no-brain farming champion when you get this far in the game. Super random Lilia encounter. Mm, we could probably stay. Well, let's actually go back. I'm gonna buy my uh, I'm gonna buy my next ultimate. Sell this one. We don't need that anymore. I've got the fire will. Okay. But to your question, guys, I know that you guys are talking about this for <laughs> like two games in a row. Yes, GP is a well, Gangplank is a very hard, a hard champion. It is not easy getting into Gangplank. You know, definitely. But if you can master the champion, you can be so, so strong with it. And don't get me wrong, I, yeah, I know a lot about pretty pretty much most champions in the game. Gangplank is one of the few champions I, to be honest, I barely play myself. I don't really play Gangplank that much, but I know exactly like how he should be played. It's just that controlling the barrels is one of the things and like positioning the barrels those are the most crucial okay. oh that was so good oh. can i catch him i'm gonna try it But yeah, like, controlling the barrels and positioning in a good way, it really makes Gangplank a lot easier. You know, me personally, I barely play Gangplank. I just know the positioning and how barrels are, you know, being put and how you should kind of, like, kite. If you know the basics of, around these things, it's really not that hard getting into Gangplank. It's just a ma matter of mastering the champ, you know? Ooh. What? What? Did I just do like 2,000 damage with like one barrel? <laughs> oh, that's insane, man. I know I do a lot of damage, but I literally just killed Lulu like one barrel. <laughs> I don't even have Infinity Edge yet. Like even me personally, I'm just surprised with like the damage of Gangplank. This is this is something that you just don't see in the, another champions at all. This is crazy to me. The wave clear is also absolutely insane. But yeah, Gangplank is definitely uh, a champion if you pick it up. You know how to play it. It's like it's very rewarding, man. It gets you really far.
Hmm, not enough, unfortunately. But I suppose we could try killing Kellista up here. Um, I guess? She's gonna continue pushing? Wait, what? <laughs> uh. Oh, oh! I'm actually dead. <laughs> oh, this champion is actually busted, man. Absolutely. <laughs> if you get this far in the game, man. I, I, I'm gonna buy Infinity Edge right now, so we don't even have the maximum damage yet. <laughs> we still have to buy these items. Unbelievable. <sighs> I don't know what to say. I want to go for Lord Dominic's, but it's not really worth. Not this game, at least. I'm more thinking about going for Mortar Reminder because of the um, the healing from Kalista is what I'm thinking about. I think I might actually build this instead. And again, like this is not bad, but I think I'm going to build this anyway. Here we go. Shen is... I don't really do much damage on him, but like, he's a tank, so it makes sense. Uh, lots of things happening. I actually got nothing off here. Mm, okay. Oh, ah, I want to barrel the second one, thank you. Ah, that was going to be like so many kills, dude. <laughs> Good reach. These fights are pretty unfortunate. Ah, my team should have this one. Ah, man, that's so unfortunate. I don't know, man. There was this, um, I wish I could replay this part, but um, I had my barrel up here and I wanted to barrel to the right and then Q, but I accidentally queued before placing that second barrel. And I think that would have probably been the entire difference in this fight. I think that that one play could have actually made us win the game. And I missed it. Feels bad, man. I need like a hundred gold. Yeah, my play. I, I messed up there. I, I missed that one barrel that would have made the entire difference. My bloody. Anyway, I need like 30 gold. You guys say you need a lifesteal item? Nah, I, I don't need a lifesteal item. Ooh, nice. Oh man, Brawler's Claw. I love this item on GP. Ooh, man. <laughs> the cleaning. Absolutely insane. Yeah, uh, Vex is still a champion we gotta be careful for. He can kill us quite easily. Nice. Let's get my final upgrade and then... We're good to go. Get to moving. 
Nice. Now I got my triple ultimate upgrades. I mean, my uh, my third one. And we're also about to reach level 18, so we're 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 getting maxed out now. Not the best barrels, but yeah. Let's go. Let's go to the inhib. We're level. Uh, we're about to reach level 18 right now. Oh, that clear. Ooh, that clear is so lovely, man. Yeah, this game is done. Oof, imagine if that one lands. Wow, this guy actually has... He, he actually risked it. He was walking into my barrel. It's just that I don't have my barrel. <laughs> They're going for me, or... <laughs> if that one lands, man. <laughs> oh, what are they doing? Though? Are they chasing me down? What on earth are they doing? Huh? What are you guys doing? Like they're chasing me down? I just don't understand. I don't understand the, what are they doing? Oh, there was one barrel. Woo, woo. Oh, insane. Yo, imagine, imagine if I could get that triple, uh, triple barrel off and like hit the entire team with barrels. Imagine like how that would end. <laughs> like I did a barrel. I believe I, uh, I believe I killed Shen. I believe I hit him, and I did like eighty percent of his health bar with like one, one barrel. Imagine if I stacked up my barrels and like. Put it through the entire enemy team and hit like one barrel. <laughs> Imagine, dude. Alright, here we go. Here we go again. Real fun begins. Everything ready and set. TP in 15, got flash. To be honest, if my team groups now, it's probably game. A slit throat is too painless. Wait, what? She nearly wins against me? Eh, she walked into my range though. Oh, my Gears. Oh, my Gears. I want to see the damage done after the game. This is insane. Yeah, the game is over. Wow. And they're buffing Gangplank. Huh. They're buffing Gangplank. Hmm. Reconsider Riot, please. <laughs> Either way, guys, this is Gangplank Top. Thanks so much for watching today's YouTube video, and I'll see you next time. Peace.